Hello, I'm Juliette Fay, and this is another quick video showing you how to get your personal profile uh, featured on your Facebook page and how to get your Facebook page featured on your personal profile. So go to the Facebook page that you, where you're an admin and you'll see here we've got edit page if you click on there and go to update info. When you go in here you've got a menu on the left hand side and you want to go to featured and then you'll see that down here you can feature the page owners. So this page is the Welsh Poultry Centre. Steve Merritt is one of the page owners but when you click on edit you'll be shown anyone else who has admin permissions for the page. So I can tick my um, self there, Juliet Fay, and then I'll be featured as a page owner as well. It's also worth having a look at here is uh, the likes. You can add featured likes. As you see, we've got five here for the page. Uh, bear in mind, it's a good idea to ask good uh, close friends and family perhaps to feature your pages if they have a page. OK, so let's go and look at the page and see where it appears. If you go down to the About section on your page, then you'll see that the page owners are now featured and there's a link across to your own personal profiles. OK, now when you go back to your personal profile, um, it will also now feature your pages. Again, if you look in the About section, uh, that will bring up, if we scroll down now, that will bring up the pages uh, that you um, are an administrator for. So we've got the Welsh Poultry Centre page here. So that's it. Uh, it's just a quick tip to give your page a bit more visibility by making sure uh, that you cross-promote between your personal profile and your Facebook page. That's it. All for now.